Yo, what's up guys? It's your host, Lifting Freezer 25 back here again. It is an absolutely beautiful day here in the West Midlands area. And I think today has been a very, very good day. I saw a few buses, lots of Envio 400s, and Tridents. I did see a Trident as well, but I got these. That's right. Today I've got one of the biggest hauls I've probably ever purchased from Entertainer. So. Yep, that's not all. I already unboxed this one. The. Uh, Volts. Not Volkswagen, Volvo. Actually, it's too warm, I'm going to do it inside. Yeah. When you hold it. Look at that dog on me as well. Hello, Frasier. Frasier. Frasier, come here. Come here, Frasier. Right. It's quite warm outside today. So, I'm going to do it for me instead. First, I've got the 73 Hot Wheels Jeep Day J10. Yep. There it is. Looking beautiful. And we're going to unbox this one first. So, I hope you guys are having a great day. Is watching this, and there it is. Nice looking casting. This is only thing, only gripe is that Hot Wheels haven't painted details on the front, but other than that, though, it's a good car. Truck is, I mean, it's not, it's, a, it's the truck. So, there it is. J J10 and the next one I got was one I already unboxed and that's in the in the store and I'm saying oh no oh, oh, um I got this today it's the Jeep it's the um not the Jeep Volvo P1800 Gasser and I'm dedicating that video to my friend Lucas who is from Sweden so that's for you. Oh, can't take on the floor. My friend Lucas from Sweden, if you're watching this video, I hope you like that. So, you do like, you do like Volvos and Scania's. Here's a card. I was very pleased I did get it today. And these ones I will be keeping because I purchased them from the UK. So these cards will be in the box of like, what do you call it, of collectors. So that's, that's, the, um, these little plastic bits can go in the trash, I don't care about those. What I do care about though, is this, about the, um, Right, I purchased one of these for the lols. No safe chat too. I know you despise these things, but there it is. It's the Volkswagen ID bus. I am personally not a big fan of these either, but um, I'm not gonna warn you to be honest, but to the side it looks quite nice. So and I've just purchased this because it is it a very nice hot casting. You've got to get them all. So, okay, that packaging can't be preserved now. Can't collect that if it's not in good condition. I can only collect the packages if they're the cards still intact. But there it is. The Hot Wheels 
Volkswagen ID bus. And right off the bat, no painting details on the front. Mattel, please, if you're listening, please stop being lazy. I beg you to stop being lazy too. Just paint the details, it's not hard. Matchbox has done it already. Anyways, it's a nice looking casting anyways, apart from that minor gripe. This is a good stuff, as you know, it's only got the um, things. It's only got the. Um, I just knocked on some front. It is this, it's the Hot Wheels Toyota Land Cruiser. In case the Jeep's, the Jeep's say, um, Jeep say Jeep J10 wasn't a J and in case in case in case most of these were all in case hot wheels. Next, I've got a Chevy Chevette as well. Again, all these popular ones are end cases, so nice to keep that packaging because it's um, not in bad condition. And then we'll go and count in a minute how many I've got if I remember to do that. Anyways, let's look at the Chevy Chevette. It doesn't look very American, does it? It looks more like a Japanese car, doesn't it? But it is American, I can inform you that. 1976 Chevy Chevette. 2022 Mattel made in Malaysia. In fact, all the hottest ones are made in Malaysia. And here it is. One that I think... I'll save the best or last. You guys always saw it. All the JDM spans. Um, got this one next. It's the Mer 65 Mercury Comet Cyclone. I think this is going to be hard to unbox. Yep. Well, actually, it's okay. I, no, actually, no, it's not. I only keep patches if they're in good condition. It's not worth keeping patches if, they, if, you, if you've ever they're ruined like they have been here. If you are a package collector, my advice to you would only be collecting, collecting packages if they're in good condition. There you go. Very, very nice looking car. Okay. 65 met increased comet cyclone. 2022 Mattel made in Malaysia. And we've got. Oh, next on the matchboxes. Now, the matchbox. If you're listening to this, the matchbox is um, always doing the detail that Hot Wheels doesn't, doesn't always forget. They're just better than Hot Wheels, in my opinion. They're worth displaying. They look better than Hot Wheels, so I think they're just better. Matchbox makes better detailed cars than the Hot Wheels does. So, well, apart from the premiums, Hot Wheels do make a good premium. Um, no, not in that It's not in that position. I've, I've found myself only collecting packages now if they're in good condition you can see what they are. It's not worth it, I don't think, anymore. But I don't know. Very, very nice looking car. I love Porsches, this one's no exception. 
mean, this is a 2020 Jim Town. No, it's not. It's a 1999-2019 re-release Mattel, made in Thailand, made in week 26 of 2022. Right. Oh, I've got some box of Hot Wheels, man. I am silly. Um, Toyota Land Cruiser. No, I'm saying it was last. This is for all of the. American fans, it's for all, it's a Ford 1965 Ford Coupe C900 truck. Beautiful, I like that. <laughs> and it looks like you can attach a trailer to it as well. So if you've got any Matchbox trailers, I'm sure they'll work here. What a nice looking casting that is. I am a fan. It seems to top over a bit though. 21 Mattel made in Thailand. I'm going to save the two best hot bits to last. 1934 Chevy Master Coupe. Out oh, that comes. I'm putting the on me guys, isn't it? So if you hear when you go to the microphone, it's because of the logic. The EM fans on me, sorry. There we go. Anyways, there it is. This Matchbox 1934 Ford Coupe, or Coupe, is nice enough to go in the cabinet, I think, because look. Matchbox always does it best for the detail. So good. I love Matchbox. Now uh, we have Toyota Land Cruiser 18. There it is. Hot Wheels Land Toyota Land Cruiser. This is the newest style of Land Cruiser compared to the old one. And Toyota always were used to copy Jeep as well. 2020 Mattel made in Malaysia, made in week 19 or 2023 though, because it is one of the new castings and not the old ones. And this is my first truck with the back thing. Back. This is something that my dad got me. It is a Hot Wheels Premium 72 Chevy Ramp truck. Now I'm going to try and be very careful to try and preserve the artwork on this packaging. If I don't, it doesn't really matter. But there we go, let's unbox this. This is a premium as well. Mm. Oh, I don't think I'm able to preserve that now. Let 
guns. I just love cleaning hot wheels. There is that. Let's look at the car first. It's an A61 Chevy Impala. Very, very nice. I love it. Made in Thailand, 2011 Mattel, made in Thailand. Which anyone can feel out for it's a brand new vehicle. Then we've got this. The back's made entirely of plastic. It is the Chev 22 Chevy Ramp truck. 72. What a nice clean vehicle that is. I love it. 2022 Mattel made in Thailand. Made in Week 21. Oh, that's such a good haul. I'm really happy with this haul. I might be able to save it. But yeah, I am really impressed with the haul I've got today. It's worth doing. Love collecting, isn't it? It's always a great day when you buy plenty of Hot Wheels and Matchbox cars. Now, I'll I'll say it now. Do I care that I've got a collection of Hot Wheels and Matchbox vehicles? No, I don't. It's what I enjoy doing. I enjoy collecting model cars for reasons. Being a hot news collector, in my opinion, is, is great. You're always up to the new releases. You always know that something good's going to be released. And the journey never stops. You never stop collecting hot wheels and matchbox cars. Once you're into it, it's you're like addicted to it, and it's it's what's called a good addiction because everyone, has, most collectors out here now, people say it's like. Ugh, it's not. It's not a baby toy at all. People can collect Hot Wheels no matter their age. And I think that the people that say you're too, you're too old to collect Hot Wheels now and Matchboxes should just leave us collectors alone. We've got quite a haul today. <laughs> it doesn't matter what order they go in, does it? But there they go. So that's all of the haul I got today. Thanks for watching the video and goodbye.